Hi, I'm Steve Ince, and you may know me from my previous adventure game work, uh, particularly on maybe this Broken Sword series, So Blonde and Captain Morgan. My name is Bill Tiller, and I'm a former LucasArts artist, and I worked on such games as uh, Steven Spielberg's The Dig, uh, Curse of Monkey Island, and um, Indiana Jones and the Infernal Machine. We are Katea Games, an independent development studio from Croatia. We specialize in adventure games, and currently we're working on our next big project, uh, Captain Brave 2, A Space Travesty. It is a sequel to our favorite project, a traditional point-and-click adventure game heavily inspired by the old LucasArts and Sierra classics. Most of us started our game development careers playing the classic adventure games such as Broken Sword, Monkey Island and Beneath the Steel Sky. So when the opportunity arose to work with the legendary game designer Stevens, we immediately knew it would be a match made in heaven. It's going to be really fun because I get the opportunity to write the story, the dialogue and work on some of the gameplay. After the events of the first game, Captain Brave finds himself stranded on a um, dangerous ice planet. And in order to survive this, this predicament, he's bent his ship to keep warm. How is he going to escape from this dangerous place? He's going to carve a ship out of ice. The game is, in a way, a tribute to, to these legendary games such as Monkey Island and Broken Sword. This mix of future and past and uh, and this light steampunk theme, they, they all work pretty well. I think it's pretty interesting to dive into this original universe. I was uh, corresponding with Steve Ince uh, over email recently and he mentioned that he was working on a Captain Brave sequel. And I was very familiar with the game because uh, it was clearly very influenced by a lot of the early um, LucasArts adventure games, especially the, a lot of the work that I had done on Curse of Monkey Island. So I was like, great, that, that's cool. It's a co it's good looking game and it looks like a fun project. So we contacted Katea Games. They were very enthusiastic and they really wanted me to work on it. Captain Brave is such a strong and heroic character. And in a musical sense, he simply requires a great and memorable team. It's not always an easy task to do, but Captain Brave's sequel will be so colorful and full of all sorts of bizarre twists that will for sure give the extra kick for my inspiration. What's really important here is that even though the character is made with uh, using 3D technology, the entire game is actually 2D. This is a, an old school point and click adventure game. We need to keep the charm that the original game had. He needs to be the same old character. The biggest drawback of the original Captain Brave was a complete lack of voiceovers. And that is something we're definitely changing in the sequel. Captain Brave 2 A Space Travesty will feature fully voiced characters. Captain Brave and his comrades are so complex characters and their interpretation requests a highly professional and charismatic voice acting. It'll have beautiful hand-painted backgrounds. The game itself will be longer. It'll feature a wide array of wacky and eccentric characters and a brilliant story with Steve's unique touch. It's gonna be downright awesome. All right, cool, I get to work on a fun game. This is gonna be a good game and it's gonna be a blast to work on. And I promise I'm gonna make this one of the best looking games possible. Now, obviously we can't do this game without your help because in order to bring this game to fruition, we need some support um, from the adventure game community. We want to deliver a fantastically funny game um, that really kind of like builds on the strength of the, the characters, brings in new characters, has a lot of fun. We're going to try and make it as original as Monkey Island, as funny as the Day of the Tentacle, and even better than Broken Sword 5. Hi Charles. And we know that you'll love it because we're really behind this game ourselves. We think it's fantastic.